Hi friends! Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been like 10 years literally since I have posted anything. Um, I am trying to get my life together. <laughs> I'm about to start posting once a week for you guys and I have a list of videos that I want to film. So I'm really excited about what's to come and I hope you guys are too because I know it's been a long time so hopefully you guys like still care and you're still excited. I have switched out a lot of the products that I use to be like non-toxic um, and really safe for me and my family so I'm gonna kind of take you guys along with me. Um, I'll show you guys like all the different products that I use, um, makeup and like hair care and all the things. Um, so I'm just gonna show you guys kind of how I've transitioned to living a healthier, non-toxic lifestyle. And I hope that interests you. Um, I'm still gonna do my makeup tutorials. They're just gonna be with different products. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling so that we can start this video. Um, I'm really excited to be back and I have definitely missed recording videos for you guys and being on here. So hopefully you enjoy and let's get started. Okay, so to start out, I'm going to go in with a primer. This is the Lancome LA Base Pro. It is so smooth and creamy and it feels really, really good on the skin. If you have oily skin, you might not like this. Um, my skin is dry right now, so I feel like it just sucks it all up and it's really nice. Um, it does say that it's an oil-free primer, um, but just from like the texture consistency of it, I feel like if I was oily, maybe I wouldn't love it. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my first foundation color. Um, this is the Savvy Minerals Foundation, and it's the shade Warm 2. Okay, and then I'm just gonna take this flat, it's a little rounded on the top, it's not totally flat, but it's really dense. Um, I'm gonna take this brush, this is the Morphe Jaclyn Hill, um, JH03 is the number of it. And okay, so I poured my foundation into the lid, and then I just tap my brush in, and then I just pat it on to like my cheeks and then I'll rub it in a little bit now this is not super full coverage like I said this is just like my daily and then I'll do a more full coverage with the liquid foundation and concealer and stuff later but this is like a really it's a really pretty natural look um because i feel like it evens out my skin without covering it up so you can still kind of see my skin through the foundation um but it covers up any like redness or anything like that okay so now that i have warm two all over my face i'm gonna go in with warm one and a smaller kind of like pointier brush um this is also a Morphe Jaclyn Hill brush. This is the JH07. Okay, and same thing, I just put it in the lid and then I'm gonna put this under my eyes. So it's a shade lighter, so I just like to put that in the areas that I want to highlight. So if you're someone that usually highlights with concealer, um, I just apply this in like the same areas. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in to contour slash bronze. Um, I'm gonna use the Savvy Minerals Dark 2 foundation. Um, Savvy does have a bronzer. I just don't love it because it is like a shimmer and I don't love a shimmer bronzer, so I just use the foundation because it's matte, but totally up to you. Sometimes in the summer I will do like the darker foundation and then I'll go over it with the shimmer um, just to like glow a little bit more in the summer. Okay, so I put it in the lid just a little bit and I like tap off any excess and then I just go in like on my cheekbones. So when I do this, 
I go from like the top of my ear down and I kind of have a line that I can follow. So you create a line from like the top of your ear down to like your mouth and then you go above that. So you don't want to go underneath here because you're trying to create that shadow. So you want the underneath part to be light and then above it to be bronze. And then I just take it up my temple and then onto my forehead a little. Okay. And then I take just a little bit and I go along my jawline. Okay, so for blush, I'm going to use the Tarte Amazonian Clay Brush. It's in the shade Party. And this brush is a Luxie 660. Um, I don't know where I got this. I feel like it might have been like back in the day when I got um, Ipsy bags. So I start on like the apple of my cheek and then I just brush it up. Okay, so to highlight, I'm going to use the ABH and Amrezy Highlighting Palette. It is literally so freaking pretty, you guys. Still not over it. And the ABH A23 brush. Okay, and then I just take my finger to go on the tip of my nose and down the bridge and then I just blend it out a little with the brush. Okay, so next I'm going to do my eyebrows. Um, I still use the ABH Brow Wiz in Medium Brown. Okay, next I'm going to take the Savvy Minerals Multitasker, and it's in the shade Light. Okay, and I'm just going to take this big fluffy brush. Um, this is also an ABH brush, and I'm assuming it's one that came with a palette because there's no number on it. And I'm just going to dip into the Multitasker, and then I'm going to run that in my crease. So the multitasker you can use as an eyeshadow, you can use it for your eyebrows. Um, some of the darker ones you can use as like an eyeliner. But this is a good like neutral color to just throw in your crease um, and make it look like you're really put together when you're really not. And I don't do this every day just depends on what's going on. I'm just going to take the other side of it, the little flat brush, and I'm going to go in with the Sappy Minerals Diamond Dust Powder. And I'm just going to put that on the lid. This is just a nice, pretty shimmer. Like I said, this is like the easiest way to appear really put together. And I'm just going to put that on my inner corner as well. This is like the perfect inner corner shade. 
and you can take any like white shimmery color for this okay the last thing I'm gonna do is my lashes so I'm going to curl them and then I'm going to use the physicians formula um, killer curves mascara physicians formula is a brand that like every time I look up any of their products um, they all have really good ratings like usually under like a three so I love getting products from them okay I'm just gonna throw on some lip balm really quickly um usually since this is like my everyday I don't wear like a lipstick I will sometimes do like a lip gloss um, I just don't have one right here so there we go that's basically it um, so it's just a couple products and it's super easy to do and this is just what I do like on a daily basis I work at home so like I don't do anything super fancy this is just my I'm not leaving the house unless I'm getting Starbucks so I want to look kind of cute but not too cute you know you feel me I'll have another video coming up soon where I'll show you guys like a going out look where I'll do a full makeup routine and show you guys all of the things that I do all the steps that I do all the products I use all the things so yeah I know it's been a hot minute but I'm trying to get myself on a schedule of posting once a week so I have like a list of ideas that I want to do so just wait it's gonna be great and I can't wait for you guys to see all the videos I'm gonna do if you haven't yet or if you're new around here uh, make sure that you like and subscribe so that you can see the future videos that I'm gonna be doing and I will see you guys next time bye